We are Team B4, and this is our remote controlled metal detector robot for ELEC 291. Using two microcontroller systems, battery power, and two JDY40 radio modules, we are able to wirelessly control the robot's movement from the remote and send data back to the remote to be displayed on an LCD. To detect metallic objects, a coil inductor made from magnet wire is positioned at the front of the robot. With a Culpitz oscillator, we can detect metallic objects near our inductor based on the changes in frequency of the oscillator. If a metallic object is detected, a signal will be sent to the remote which will play a specific beep frequency on a speaker, depending on how metallic the object is. In this footage here, we have placed coins along the path of the robot, and the larger coins produce a greater metallic strength compared to the smaller ones. An additional feature we designed was the implementation of a password locking mechanism on the remote. Using a series of switches to set and enable the password, and push buttons to lock and unlock the remote, we were able to prevent unwanted movement from the remote unless the correct password is inputted into the switches. Another feature we implemented was a mode that mimics a Roomba by switching the leftmost switch on this switch on the remote. To adjust the settings of the Roomba mode, the second rightmost switch can be enabled. Changing the time settings of the Roomba mode adjusts the repeating time in which the robot will systematically move in a zigzag pattern. Lastly, as a measure for calibrating the inductance of the coil in different locations, we have implemented a base inductance feature that allows us to set a certain detected inductance as a reference value. On the LCD, the current and reference inductance values are displayed, and by pressing a push button next to the LCD, we are able to set the current inductance as the reference inductance. This feature is particularly useful for calibrating to environments that may have more metallic objects or magnetic fields in the vicinity that may affect our inductance values and our ability to detect metallic objects. In terms of components, we use an STM32L051 microcontroller system on our robot and an EFM8LB12 microcontroller board on our remote, which transmitted and received signals from each other using a pair of JDY40 radio modules. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.